Hello everyone, welcome back to another retro. Let's give it a go. Today we're checking out a game called Winter Challenge. This is also a very, very nostalgic game. I don't know where we got a copy of this um, back in the day, but a very classic DOS game for me at least. Uh, if you remember that, uh, what is it, Olympic Games on the NES? This is basically the Winter Olympics one on old DOS systems, which was very uh, in detailed. <laughs> So let's train because I have no idea again how this work. There's a lot of events as you can see, especially for an old game like this. Let's just do... Uh, what? Speed downhill? Sure, train. What's the keys? I have no idea. Oh god, this is loud. Let me quickly turn down my volume a little bit. There we go. Oh, that's a black screen. Sorry. Just want to turn down the volume a little bit. Nice. Okay. So that might have been, might have been a little flashing there, but... Okay, so let's see. Go. How do you play? Uh, so arrow keys as usual. Just go down. Do I hold down? Remember, this is slow down. So back is slow down. Is forward just going fast, or do you not even have to play? So it's basically down in the slalom, as you can expect, but pretty basic. Just set the tournament record is one minute fifty-five. Can I take the? Uh, no, I don't want to go on the rough snow. Can I take the the corners quickly? Make it as fast as possible. Now, I don't think there's any randomization. This was, as I said really long ago there's no randomization in the courses it stays the same exactly every single time you play and i am not sure what winter games was out this time of uh, in and uh, what's it in history and um, because we don't really participate our country doesn't participate in winter olympics we, are, we live in africa and the <laughs> winter with us is just rain we don't see snow and there's only one location in the whole country that it snows in, and it may, basically for about two days a year or so there's no winter sports. We do have very small representation of ice hockey, but not in ever any competitive uh, aspect. And I only know about one ice hockey rink in the whole uh, sector here where I live. So, in fact, I don't even know if that ice hockey rink exists anymore. I haven't been there in probably a decade. Oh, God. I feel slow. I feel like I should be able to go even faster. Because I'm still quite a ways away and I'm already at the 155. Oh god. No, please, please. Why is that corner so sharp? Yeah, I'm really bad though. I just noticed the bottom right. You can see your speed. I mean, 40 uh, kilometers an hour is still pretty fast. To be going uh, downhill, especially for a human. But now we're now we're talking sixty kilometers now, it's almost seventy. I'm gonna have to take a sharp turn over here. Come on, no bank, bank. There we go. Extremely slow suddenly, but oh well, probably a downhill through the the gates. And across the finish line. It's suddenly the cheer for me. Nice. There was even replay systems. Amazing. Back in the day. Let's try something different. Uh, luge. Isn't this like skeleton? It's the difference between luge and skeleton. If I remember that correctly, this was extremely difficult. This is very easy to fly off the, the set. Or of the the book course. Mm. So you want to bank into the corners, just pick up speed, but also not too much to fly off. When I was uh, small, I did not. Uh, yeah, when I was younger, not just small, uh, I did not know about banking into the corners to speed up. So I was just going through the middle and thinking that's how you're supposed to go. 
to get fast. Flying past that corner. I'm holding forwards for some reason. I don't think it's going to make a difference right here. I think I only need to focus on the arrows. Take another corner there. A little bit wider. Pick up speed. There we go. So this course time is 107. Again, I'm almost there and I'm only halfway. Somewhere losing a lot of speed. Go. Take the corner. Sharp, sharp, sharp. That's not too bad. Three seconds behind the, the tournament record. It was uh, actually better than I thought. Nice. New event. Maybe go to the main menu and just start a tournament. Select competitors. This is the part I can remember. You can select opponents and stuff. So, add. Uh, let's select. Uh, as you can see, no one in the sun. It's the southern hemisphere is even mildly at the games because there's no icy winters really there. Uh, I think in South America, there's a lot of, in, uh, close to the Andes, there would be a lot of uh, snowy areas. But that's very steep mountains. Um, so yeah, that's not going to be perfect for these type of windows, for exactly the same reason there's nothing in Tibet. So, <laughs> you see China there, but no, no Tibet. Um, what am I going to take? That's, look at how old this is, look at the Russian flag. <laughs> I just know that it's still the Soviet flag. <laughs> uh, let's just call me done. I'm going to choose... Let's be from the UK, that's the closest to us. Uh, to mine. There's UK. UK flag. You can choose different pictures. Let's choose this dude with a block head. Sounds good. So that's me. Select opponents. Who do I want? I've got no records. These guys, you can see where they're, they rank. Skill amateurs. Professionals. World class. Oh my god, these guys are amazing so let's stick to amateurs uh i'll choose let's choose some of choose one good guy so harken come on and more players no 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 cancel cancel select opponents how do i oh do i just select all of these okay so open ceremony that's how i pick it so i just play against all the amateurs Never mind then. But as you can see, you could play multiplayer there. Easily. That's uh, the way we did it in the... In the younger years. Nice opening ceremony for the... Definitely not copyrighted Winter Olympics. That's why it's called Winter Challenge. And you hear the... The, the quality Dolby sounds. <laughs> uh, so... Standings. Uh, what are we going to do first? Let's end with these two since we've already done this. Let's do, is this cross country? Yeah, it's cross country. This is going to take a while, right? Cross country skiing is an endurance sport requiring great strength uh, in the legs and stamina. Sure. Yeah, next competitor. Whatever. Three, oh, almost four minutes the record. So how do I choose my stamina and stuff? You can see the energy at the bottom. I know there's a way to uh, shove yourself forward. Maybe it does it automatically when you go up uphill. Because I'm pressing. Was it enter? Oh, enter. Okay, nice, nice. It's a downhill. I can slide. I'm gonna uh, shove myself forward doing enter. Come on, it's uphill, so climb, 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 climb. Corner's probably going to be downhill. The energy meter also doesn't really explain anything. Uh, unless I'm still at full energy. Does it change color? Something? I really cannot remember anything like that. Or does it... Oh, I'm, oh it's full on uphill. I just stopped right there for two seconds. 
Oh, you can see the energy bar going down now. But what can I do? It's uphill. Okay, finally a little bit of downhill. Come on, pick up some speed. Where's my speed? There's no, no speedometer, so I'm not seeing if I'm actually moving. Uh, the graphics is not helping a lot with that. But I'm almost halfway through the the record time, and I'm not close to halfway through the race. Pick up speed. Come on, pick up speed. Pick up speed. I know there's a, a shooting area also where you do the cross country, but you have to shoot at certain areas. Really fun. Also really difficult. It seems uphill, so let's quickly boost a little bit. Come on, come on, come on. There we go. Got some energy. Now, it sucks that there's no sound effects in, for some reason or music in this area. Not sure why that happened. Come on. Move around the corner. Still all basically uphill this. I mean, they can definitely remake this game uh, in modern times. And have it extremely fun. Because mostly, there's not a lot of Olympic games or getting released. Still, and most of them are some, some Olympic games. I mean, one of the pop most popular ones still is... What's it, London 2020? Uh, no, London 2012. What was it? What am I saying? London 2012, that's one of the more popular ones. Uh, I think Tokyo 2020 was the one, and that one was not successful at all. The game, at least. Uh, Winter Olympics, was there one recently? Was there a Sochi one? I think so. And that's also been quite a while ago. I'm already past the record time and I still have quite a ways to go. Hopefully the other guys are just as bad. Come on, round the corner we go. Come on, I have to be at least sub 420. <laughs> Today is the 420. So I have to at least try for that. Come on, come on, come on. The 20th of April. So happy 420, everyone. That's spoiler for when I'm recording this, but you'll see it. That's the day I'm going to release it, so. Oh, God. Not sub 20. But uh, anyway, 420. Extremely bad. Yeah, not even close. I mean, I'm still 10 seconds away from Jay Hernan, but. The Rue. That would have been Le Rue, in anyway. It's French. Uh, let's go. I'm not lost, so it could have been worse. You can even watch the instant replay. Don't think I'm gonna watch another four minutes. Tournament menu. Let's operate. Let's go bobsled. Oh, it actually shows what country beat me there, Finland. So there's a fast by sport. Yeah, so it's the same as good. Now I wonder if I can get some speed also by pressing enter or let's let's find out. No, oh, this one you have to run, so maybe tapping enter to start. Get in. Why are you, st oh, you still running? Uh, with this one, uh, unlike the the luge, you can actually tip tip the the bobsled. You go too too wide. There's not enough momentum to carry you. I feel like I'm really really fast. Well, it's about eighty kilometers an hour. Almost a hundred now. Let's go, let's go, let's go. Climb up, climb up, climb up. Let's go. Slide perfectly downhill. Outside the side. Again this side. 
Whoa, wrong side. I've always wondered, uh, how do you control the bobsled? Is it like a little steering wheel that controls the ski to the front? How does it work? Yeah, almost beat the tournament record. But that guy did beat the tournament record, so what the freaking heck? Harkin, you cheating little guy. So, I'm almost lost. I thought it was amazing. Wow. <laughs> okay, so this is... Is this... No, that is ski jump. So this is just... This is probably uh, normal slalom. Giant slalom. There we go. Next competitor. Ah, so... That's... It's pretty downhill. Can I just... Can I still boost myself? No. But it is slalom, so I have to... Cut close to the corners. Control for this. There's no... Med animation, so... Oh god. I'm taking very wide corners there. Oh, oh, there we go. I think that was pretty perfect, that one corner there. Oh! Oh, that was way too wide. But yeah, since we don't have uh, winter sport in our country, I, I know nothing about most of it. Uh, most of my winter sport knowledge I gained from this when I was a young lad, so... Um, other than the sports year, I have no idea if there's any different sports actually in the Winter Olympics. Uh, as I said, I know about skeleton, but as far as I knew, that was the same as luge, so... Not entirely sure. That's fine. Oh, I'll also know curling. Curling is a sport, right? Uh, that's something I might actually be interested in. It's very st strategic. There we go. How far am I? Oh, close to the end. No! It's so close! Look at that! No! I think I was on record pace. I definitely would have beat them. Well, at least at 156. ENF. No. Wait, just screwed up. So let's do some uh, ice skating. Speed skating, I mean. Best. Definitely figure skating also as part of the mix, I'm pretty sure. Uh. <laughs> Look at that. That's the guy. Okay, so enter is just moving. Using my left hand to tap enter is not comfortable, but... Oh well, I am left-handed. So I might as well get used to it. Let's change hands. Because I can tap faster with my right hand. I only need have to press left, so... <laughs> on the, the arrows. <laughs> I clipped right through the wall there. Well, another failure for me there. That guy, again, beats the records. Man, these guys are pretty good. Uh, let's do... Biathlon! So this is the full cross country. This is a full cross country. It's a different cross country, but now I also have to shoot. Go. Come on, get a little speed. I wish I could see the speed on this. Just to see how much I gain. This is a little bit uphill. Come on, come on, come on. This is downhill, so just move. And a little bit of speed there. Maybe tap once every two seconds. I think that should be enough to to carry my endurance and my, my stamina. For this I need to tap. This is a massive uphill. With the shooting on the left. Come on. Climb, climb, climb. 
we go, got the target. And you control this with the keyboard. Oh, with the keyboard, it's terrible. Oh god, it's terrible. Here we go. Look at that sudden ricochet. That's that's fine. Penalty time, 15. Oh my god, 45 seconds. That's a whole minute. Mm. Well, almost a minute. <laughs> my, it's 15 seconds off a minute. Okay, come on, climb, 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 and then ski to your heart's content. Well, it's not looking good for me, guys. I don't see any uh, record-breaking scores here, but... Oh, well. Go, go, go. Go, 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 go. Oh, why am I doing that? Quickly, quickly, quickly. Now I'm lying down. Smaller target. Even worse. That's not even close. Nice. Nope. Another 30 seconds. That's another 30 second penalty. Actually, one of these are 30 seconds each. What is going on with this? Oh my god, I know nothing about this. I, I remember this vaguely, but I don't remember the time penalties. And mostly when we were, were children, I, I was playing like against my sister and my best friends and stuff, so... Uh, the AI didn't really matter. It just was the less, less worse of us all. Oh, come on, come on, come on, come on. That was probably about, when I played this, probably about 8, 9, 10 years old. I remember playing in our garage. This is a really big target, but I still somehow missed it. Twice. This guy definitely has some... Has to take some calming tablets or something because, man, he's jittery. Mm. Well, this is uphill. I'm already almost past the record. I still have one more target to go and a quarter of the field. Which mostly seem uphill from here. Go, 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 climb. I'm almost out of stamina. Little cars going. Little cable car things. Okay, gain some stamina. Gain some stamina. I feel like there's going to be another uphill right after that uh, target. Well, do you gain stamina back while aiming? Because I think you're standing still though, so I think it'd give you a little resting time. Maybe not calming you because you're still going to be stressed to shoot, but that's good. Nope. The time is still ticking while I'm shooting, so taking long just cost me everything. If one is a gray, what do I get for gray? No idea. I'm setting uh, new records on bad times. But I will not DNF this one. Screw that. I probably will DNF the the ski jump. <laughs> if I remember correctly, that's extremely difficult. But I don't think I, I'll uh, fail the luge. I might fail it, but probably not. And definitely not the downhill one. Come on, give me some speed. This is all downhill. I still have a lot of stamina. Just go, 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 go. Tap, tap, tap. Here we go. 8 minutes 16. <laughs> Those guys beat the record. Harkin. <laughs> 2 minutes 30 behind. Nice. Nice, nice, nice. Okay, so ski jump. Now, I don't remember. Do you get 3 attempts again? Like all the other... Winter Olympics and you know, jump sports or summer Olympic sports. How does this work? How does this work? Not like that. 
how do you... The record is 92. Okay, there's uh, uh, apparently not any other things. But how is the record 92 and I got 60? How do you pick up speed? Enter did nothing there. Well, might as well go to Luge. This is my chance, man. This is my chance. Go, go, corner. Take that corner. Let's take it high. Take the corner high. Go, go, go. Pick up speed. Not too high, but pretty high. Nice, nice, nice. Pick up speed. This is a slow little part there, but pick up speed. Go, go, go. That side, this side. Go, pick up speed. I think every time you hear that a little scratch is me losing speed. Maybe it's just sound effects. Who knows? I definitely don't know. I was losing speed there somehow. This doesn't make sense, but okay. I'm picking up speed. A lot of speed. I'm losing speed again there. And finish. Nope, that was bad. Seven seconds behind the record. That's definitely going to be last place. I feel like they're probably going to beat the record again. No, actually not, but... Yeah. I mean, I said actually not, but it was pretty close. Yeah, I'm last place. <laughs> oh, God. Last thing. Downhill. Let's go, I'm not waiting for for any other things. There's nothing else I can press, right? Only enter and enter does nothing on this. So it's just the lines that take. Going uphill obviously there is pretty bad. No, that is also very bad. I wanna go inside. Now I don't know if it's, the game is this accurate when going inside on the downhill. If it actually measures the speed there. But oh well. Off I go. Now, this is only the amateur guys, so how the heck are you supposed to beat the top guys? I mean, some of the things you can see, some improvements. Uh, where I screwed up quite a lot. Oh god. Oh god. But other things... I don't feel like I screwed up that much, and I was not even close to the top of the amateur guys. How the heck do you beat the, the gold medalists? The pros. It feels like the course is changing right out of my feet. I'm going straight and then suddenly there's a, a gap between me and the course changing. <laughs> How far am I? Uh, still quite a ways away. Yeah, so taking the hill over here will give me more speed down this. But still only going 60. The inside line would be better here if I can keep it. No, suddenly he stopped turning for some reason. Now I'm only getting 40, so this is really bad already. Yeah, I'm way past the time, and I still have one more corner to go. Yeah, I'm just pressing other keys just to see if there's anything else I can do. But oh well, doesn't seem like it. Take this course, uh, this corner, pretty sharp. On the thick snow, why not, right? Try to turn as little as possible here. There we go. Ooh, recordly bad. Almost 14 seconds slower. They all beat the record. How the heck? Look at that. 34 seconds off uh, past the guy closest to me. 
Oh man. Okay, so let's see the award ceremony. Ba -bum -ba -bum. Now it's night. So everything like that. Everything that happens so far happened in one day, right? That's how it works. Now this is what a week later, four days later. How long is the Winter Olympics? Heck, this is it. I know so little, so little about it. Until the the previous Winter Olympics, we didn't even get a broadcast over here, so. Nice. Very, very nice. The standings. Harkin with 21 points, 5 gold medals, 3 silvers. And I'm at least not lost, but that's thanks to my name being in alphabetical, for, uh, alphabetical order. <laughs> I'm going to do one training of the ski jump before I end it. Just to see what the heck I'm supposed to do here. Go. So is there anything you can press? Do I have to tap this? How do you... What the heck do you do, man? What do you do? Go again, go again. Different colors. Doesn't matter. Just get me up. Oh. Extremely terrible, but I landed. 70, uh, 37. Let's try and just see if that was a fluke. So do we press up? Step up. No, look at me go sideways. And immediately I fall. So I think you press either up or, or enter to land. I'm just gonna press nothing now. See if that actually makes a difference. And then just... Again, 73. Hmm. Seventy-one. Wow. Maybe it's down. Makes no sense. Down is break. Seventy-eight. So that somehow somehow got me further. <laughs> Once more. I'm getting too into it now. I'm still the exact same speed, so... 60, nope, I have no idea. Like a throw of the dice by the looks of it. Anyway, let's get back to the main menu. Main menu. This has been a let's, let's give it a go retro look at. A winter challenge. Uh, very, very good game. Still holds up. Uh, I'm going to leave a download link if you want to check it out yourself down below. But give it a go, get your friends or your children or whatever, uh, and have some fun because this is a really, really good game. This is, uh, what's it, Abandonware now anyway, so you can easily just download it for free. Uh, it is a little bit of a hassle, you have to use DOSBox to set it up, but if you know DOSBox at all, uh, it's pretty easy. And you don't even have separate files and stuff, you have to go just throw the folder down and run it. Anyway, thank you so much for watching, and I'll see you guys in the next Retro Let's Give It A Go uh, next Thursday. Thank you, goodbye.